Hey guys and welcome back to Minecraft! My name is Twitchy and we are playing on my publicly available server. You want to come join in? There's a Discord link somewhere. Details are available. But it's a beautiful day on Lake Pizzazz. A beautiful day for making sure my collections are all up and together. For the past few episodes we have been going around. We've been making nice little collections from uh, mob heads to music discs to uh, all sorts of random things. The banner patterns are the ones that I want to talk to you about today because there are many banner patterns that are available out there and I have only got four, no, five of the six that are available to us. <laughs> if we drop down this little bit of a hole that we've got here and then I have a look, uh, we'll, we'll just ignore the things that I've not put away from last time and walk down to my corridor of collections back here with various rooms hanging off the Enderman have been coming through and dropping dirt around everywhere again. Uh, it's my musical, it's my book of everything, it's my head's room but more importantly we are coming over this way to my banner pattern room. This is the one that we've been working on for a few episodes. If you've been around you would have seen us collect all of these banner patterns but this end one here this end one here eludes me uh, we need to get ourselves a creeper face to be able to make this banner pattern and you know what for that we need a trident and a thunderstorm nearly said snowstorm <laughs> In the four years that this server has been up and running, I have had many tridents in my possession over time, but wouldn't you know, time and time again, things have just left my possession. I've thrown them into the void, uh, they've just randomly disappeared, things have been dropped. I, I should imagine I've even got some in the uh, chests out here that I have just forgotten about. But, uh, you know what, I, I am I'm a relatively technical Minecraft player, so I feel like this might be the time for us to go and build ourselves a trident farm. Now, as I say, me, Misaligned, uh, Red Lego and Mad Frank all have decided to build around this lake called Lake Pizzazz and uh, if we take a survey of the bottom, the Lake Pizzazz is a very interesting place. Mostly it's quite shallow. If we get down here and wet, wait for our water vision to kick in, you can see there's not much room there and indeed I was trying to figure out whether we could have a path, uh, a, a farm here. Uh, no, I, I didn't like that but down here, oh look at this, this guy has uh, shown us for uh, demonstration here. Down here this is a place where we can actually get a whole bunch of drowned spawning and indeed a copper is one of the things I'm going to be getting out of here but I'm mainly after a trident now to be able to make this a efficient farm I have a bit of a plan hi how are you doing uh, I have made myself a scaffolding line here this is where I want my AFK spot to be but twitchy you might say isn't this super close to the floor aren't you going to cause yourself all sorts of troubles well if we turn this on yes yeah yes i am uh, so the yellow one is well, my safety sphere you know like mobs can't spawn within a certain distance of you that's this close one the one on the outside the orange is where mobs can spawn let's jump down here so as you can see between the yellow and the orange boom uh, out here this this is all fair game this is where mobs can spawn and then all the way out to the red line out there is where like where i need to make spawn proof now you might note that these are all spheres and uh, that red one also is indeed a sphere it goes down deep underneath our feet uh, but this is kind of good this is kind of good I for uh, the past episode indeed the last episode was have been working on some giant spaceships in the end let's turn that overlay off the giant spaceships in the end and unfortunately one of the materials that I need is raw gold now the raw gold I mean it turns out that you need four, maybe five pieces of ore to be able to make a proper full uh, raw gold block. I mean, that's even with Fortune 3. Like, this this, this is me trying to be efficient about it here. So we're, we're going to... Um well, we need to light up caves, and I need raw gold. I feel like there's a bit of synergy that can happen here.
was uh, slightly more perilous than I anticipated there. It's all right. I've brought myself a shield. Would you like to come caving with me? You know what? It's been a long time since we've done any sort of caving on camera, if at all, even. Uh, so coming down here, you can see that I've put a whole bunch of uh, stairs in place. But somewhere down here, I actually made a, uh, a big, big cardinal sin and only went with uh, with one one rather than one yeah here it look look, look look at this weird little bit that i've got here uh, and i have to deal with that this is where i originally ran into uh, to monsters and bad guys and had myself a bit of a bad time uh now i do happen to know that just on the other side of this wall there are a lot of bad guys i sealed this up when they were shooting at me at like well was you saw in the time lapse going over that way. Uh, I should also bring up, like, I don't go poking around in replay mod. Obviously, I, I have the opportunity to go and do whatever I want in there. But you know what? I am full OP on this server. I could give myself any sort of situations that I want. I, I also have access to a creative test world. So I, it just, it would ruin the game for me, you know? It would absolutely ruin the game for me. So uh, I don't do that. I don't do that at all. Uh, and to that end, I have no idea what's through here. I... I'm scared. Uh, I, I'm guessing skeletons, because I think I can hear them. Oh, it's a big drop. Okay. All right. We, well, we can deal with big drop. Hello? How are you? Yeah, shoot each other. Fight. You can't really see, unfortunately, in there. Let's uh, try and put... Yeah, there we go. Oh, man, everybody's involved. Uh, you you want to wanna come and get involved as well? I mean, are they all... I mean, I'm, I'm quite happy for them to do the work for me. You know, I, I've got no problem with that. Shoot, shoot, shoot the zombie. Come on. Oh, there's another one down there as well. This might actually end up being a little bit troublesome. I did bring my own boat. But maybe I could make use of that. that. That would also be useful. I don't know why I am so reluctant to lean on the bow. I, wow. Wow, what? did you? Did, did, that's a curved shot there. You're not allowed to do those. Uh, I'm not sure why I'm so reluctant to lean on my bow. Boom. Okay, great. Uh, okay, let's... How am I getting back up here? That, that's that's a little jump route, right? Can I jump? I can't jump up like, up like that. No, mate. No. Like this. Where? Where is it? I see no one and nothing. I hear him, though. Oh, hello, Mr. Enderman. Did you just fall down? Where? This is terrifying. So I'm, I, I mentioned it last episode. I'm going to mention it again. Caving is deadly now. Caving is a real problem. Like, look at look at this space. Look at this space. How am I supposed to know how safe or or in danger I am at any moment? Now, obviously, yeah, if I was playing hardcore or whatever, I'd be uh, building myself little structures everywhere to try and protect myself. But I don't think we need that. Uh, another thing I'll be doing occasionally is pressing this and finding the edge of the sphere. That's nice. But also seeing what we've got um, dark wise. That guy just... Oh, we must have stood on a bit of um, redstone or... Hey, mate, could you... Can you not? Where'd he go? Where'd he go? Oh, <laughs> missed, missed my critical shot there, but that that's fine. That's fine. Uh, okay, so I'm just going to go around... Look, look at that. That just goes off. But I'm f fortunately, but fortunately, I don't actually need to go that way. Uh, I'll put that there for when the redstone or wears off. Uh, because that is the edge of the sphere. Wait, you can't put your shield up whilst you've got your bow in your hand. <laughs> Lol. Uh, yeah, so, so it should be all good. Let's have a look how far we got to go. Okay, that's that's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. We just need to go and do... Oh, there's, there's another another little cave going off here. Oh, and, th and here we go. This this is where the real, ah, real caving begins. Uh, one thing that I will do is... Um, I, I can kind of see a flow of the cave, uh, and I've not I've noticed over time that it's worth just kind of poking down through the ends. This one, it's not, but sometimes it just kind of narrows down and then opens back up again. Uh, so it's it's worth just kind of poking through and making sure, making sure that there is no further cave over that way. Uh, okay, th th this has gone well actually. I was kind of expecting a death and indeed with that many skeletons down there i'm expecting that to happen again let's just try and uh, i haven't got any box blocks on my bar there we go that should make me a little bit safer hello how are you doing are you up here to dance where's, where's your partner hello how, how are you doing i need to eat i've only just realized i've got i've just just replaced the fish on my bar how do I how do I get back into the cave? Hey, let's let's wait for him to come up into the cave. Like I say, caving is very dangerous in the open now. Very dangerous in the open. Is he not coming up? Is he not coming up? 
Um, he's like, I, I, did, I did three blocks of pathfinding and I can't get to you. That's good enough. He's also got an enchanted bow. Okay, that, that was good. That was good. I really need more torches closer to hand. Yeah, you know, I need... I need oh, yeah, okay. Well, why not put those there? Uh, I, well, I... I need a third hand. That's what I need. I need to be able to protect myself. I've just noticed my, my shield is about to die. I don't think I'm that bothered. I don't think I'm that bothered. Let, let's eat some steak so that we're nice and uh, healthy. And uh, I'm... Oh, no. Not, not with you there. I'm not. I'm about to go running through the heart of evil. Let's do this. Ah! Okay. Uh, it's going well. It's going well. Uh, obviously, the... We, oh. Oh. There's previous torches here. Um, obviously, the lighting up and the sphere the sphere is what i'm trying to say the despawn sphere is around here that sounds very busy behind me you, you know that sounds very very busy where am i hey i've been here before i i know that i recognize this place these couple of pillars I've, I've run around here trying to be safe many times in fact this yeah yeah yeah, yeah. this is this is somewhere where i have died a couple of times okay that's cool nice little uh, geode over there though Okay, my job now really is just to pick off the stragglers. Uh, I've got 14 of their arrows and 18 of my own. Check the overlay. Yeah, let's 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 try and climb that little wall over there. Maybe throw down an extra torch. It's probably not actually needed there, but oh hello, found ourselves another cave. That hey, what was that? I I fairly sure I had my shield up and it went just straight through there. Uh, am, I, am I wrong? Am I wrong? Replay the footage. Let's have a look. I'm, fa I'm fairly sure. I'm not going to be able to tell until I can see it in the edit, but I'd like to know. So when I've cleared out a little area like this, and I'm fairly sure this side tunnel, in fact, I know this side tunnel is now free of mobs and indeed of any material reels that I wanted to uh, to take out of here. Uh, so to save myself a little bit of a headache in the future, I will come along and just kind of seal this up. It's it's not, it's more of a symbolic sealing than anything. It's just that I can see that I have indeed come through here and that I don't need to worry that there's anything back there. No, no diamonds here. That's sad. More diamonds over there though. Beautiful. Okay, so th this was a successful lighting up session. Uh, I think we did well. Uh, there's plenty of oh, it's gold that's what i'm here for that's what i'm actually here for i don't know what to do about our ender buddy up there like he, he is moving he is moving gravel around but i don't i don't think i'm that bothered about moving gravel around i am not fond of the fact that i can hear a skeleton around here but let's go back through our little hole so we're back at the pillar where else would they be this was our stairway up and down now that i don't have any uh any torches to ha not any torches sorry the torches are what i do have in my hand now that i don't have a shield to hand i'm just gonna mostly run around with the torches and try and light up the caves as fast as possible uh mostly looking for the edge of the despawn sphere but actually just lighting up this this cave system because to find the edge of the despawn spawn sphere i'm gonna go along the uh the stairway shaft that we've got over here up and down and i'm gonna just send out spurs left and right so that i can know that i've covered everywhere where would that skeleton be i can hear it oh i found a room oh i found a room see that what i put down a block did it did, did that block interrupt his his arrow i what what just happened there so, uh, maybe he missed me. Maybe he just missed me. I, f I felt like I'd like Neo Zend him somehow there. Oh, that creeper is separated from everything. That's interesting. This is why you need to check your ends of tunnel. Look at look at this one. Look at this one. We just uncovered this. This is gonna get scary. Oh, are we good? We good? Ooh, ooh, that. That gave me a bit of a beating. Uh, we got anything back there? I mean, that that's a too high. We'll, we'll put that down. There, there could be more. There could be more. But I think that might be the end of the line here. Now that I'm <laughs> in a little corner and nice and safe. Eight gold, three diamonds, 19 redstone. Not bad, not bad. I've, I've had better hauls. I've had better hauls. But we're not done yet because this is just one end of this weird side tunnel that we found here. Uh, my plan is just to go around and light up the, uh, the, the, the actual tunnels that I find. Oh, no. Look at... 
Look at how much is here. Okay, well, we're, we're gonna go around and light these places up and, ooh, yes please, thank you very much. Uh, I think we've probably done enough of it on camera together. You, you, you've seen my process here. Um, sometimes I have this on, sometimes I have it off. It depends how far away from the edge of the despawn de -spawn sphere I am. Terrifying, terrifying zombie noises. And I will see you guys when I've uh, gone around and lit up a load of places. Well, I was walking up the stairs and I heard a zombie growl. It, he's, he's here somewhere. So this is kind of my plan anyway from uh, the stairway. So I'm just going to tunnel forwards until I find that he, he's like right here right right here right here uh, tunnel forwards until I find the edge of the despawn de spawn sphere I seem to be having trouble saying that for some reason I've said it so many times now that I'm not even sure I understand what I'm saying when I say it uh, of course that is the red boundary that I need to light up because any mobs that exist in there what do you reckon is there water at the top of this I kind of feel like there's going to be water at the top of this okay we're set we're safe okay that's that's it's fine. I was a little bit... Ooh, I missed. I missed. I was a little bit worried there for... Um, what? What is that with my torch game? What? What is, what is going on here? That we'd be uh, finding water. But of course, we're, we're not actually that high up in the system right now. Uh, looking up in the top left where it tells me my coordinates when we've got this overlay up and running. Uh, it, it's 20... Oh, hello. We're only 20 below. And I've not seen... The, ooh, oh, nice. I've not seen the edge of the sphere yet so uh i'll remember that that caves there we'll, we'll go check that out in a bit okay so here is the end of the tunnel or at least as far as i'm going now obviously that's this is not good we not we've not found all of the 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 caves on this floor we'd uh, we'd have to be going that way following the, the 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 sphere edge until we reach this side and then we're like okay well th there's no cave here and then we come back a little bit and we, we we do the same out here until we reach the sphere edge again but you know i don't i don't think that's the most exciting form of content to have for a video i don't know maybe maybe you do want to watch some serious branch mining but i think the more exciting stuff would be to come out into the caves what what do you guys think about a caving episode let me know about whether it's a good thing or a uh, bad i don't know where this goes i just want to go and have a look this is a very suspicious shaping <laughs> yeah it's content that you don't really see on youtube and there's probably a reason for that let's turn that off oh, ow. Uh, let's turn that off we don't need it in the caves it was just to help me locate the end of the sphere oh look we've uh, somewhat been here before and left the gold behind did you see that uh, of course there have been oh, oh this is nice uh, there have been times where i've been out lighting up where i've not known that gold would be such the precious resource that it is or at least raw gold would be such the precious resource that it is who just got hit by the zombie there Oh, there is water above this sand. That That is mildly terrifying. But we got a good, good haul of gold here. Good haul of gold. I'm doing exactly what I was doing down below. When I reach the... Um, please, mate, please. When I reach the end of a, uh, a branch that... Uh, of, uh, yeah, branch of the cave. Do, I, do we call these branches offshoots? Uh, cave, cave systems? I don't know. When we reach the end of it, anyway, uh, I, I come down to the, uh, the entrance. And if I've taken all the materials off, we just symbolically throw a bar over it i'm not sure whether i want all the coal or not i mean coal is very useful but it does tend to fill up you look like someone who's been here for a while you doing all right mate are you are you a long term i'm sorry i'm sorry i i always do feel a little bit weird about killing zombies that have been around for for you know actual years like so there will be some zombies down in the caves down here that have been been around all four years something like that uh, 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 especially this like regular stone generation layers that that's actually going to be a thing that is actually going to be a thing Wow, wonders of natural generation. No, not not this bit, not this bit. Look at this over here. That is crazy. Can I dig my way up there without updating it? I, I don't, I don't want to break it because that, 
Uh, I don't, I've got a feeling this is something that they've taken out of the game at some point, is this, this generation type right here. They, they, they do their best to try and uh, fix these things when they know about them. I've got a bunch of uh, grass that spawned in over the top of ponds. Used to be quite a regular occurrence that you would end up with floating grass. Not not grass block, but the actual plant grass. And uh, up, at, up at the Close Encounters farm, there's a few of those that have spawned over ponds and uh, are now just like floating plants. And I don't want to update them. I want to keep them. They're, 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 they're a thing that supposedly has been patched out of the game now. But we'll, I mean, we'll see about that. I never know what to do with these partially flooded areas. Like, is this is this really... Is, is this going to spawn some drowns in? Is this is this a thing I have to be wary of? I, I don't know. I actually don't know. Something I should... Probably look look at that little ninja move there. Just take a little step back be like no my friend. We can't do that today He's gonna shoot me I had nowhere to go. I felt it. I felt it. Uh, okay. I think we're good. Oh, hello Flooded anywhere not flooded It's a question. Oh, there's the edge of this. Oh, oh And we bust surface. I mean that's good, but also kind of not Wait, wait. We were much higher. We're much higher up than my than my stair there. Hmm. This might prove some problems. Do these hills all have caves in them that I'm gonna have to bore through to to know whether I've done it all or not? Well, I knew this wasn't gonna be a simple job. I died. Did you see that? Did you actually? I walked into the side of the lava, I placed a block down behind me, and I stood there and died because I couldn't find my way out. What is this rubbish going on here? And do you know what? To add insult to injury, after trying to get some XP levels to be able to like make all my equipment back together, I died at the gold farm. I, I don't even know how you die at the gold farm. There is no way. But I came back, Twitchy was killed by Zombie Piglin, and do you know what? And do you know what? I had what a brand new pick on me at that point uh it, it, it's painful after i died the 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 last the previous previous time you know what 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 are the times in the end uh i i said no more i'm gonna just make a whole bunch of equipment and here you go Look, i've got a shulker box full of silk touch pixels and this this is what i was working through to uh, to do all the mining uh th this one here i wasn't paying attention i broke my pick I, i'd seen it at 100 and i was like no i can go go lower i dug a branch and then I was talking and I dug the second branch and it, and it, and it broke. Uh, this one here, I, I lost it to lava. We just watched that happen. And this one lost it to the gold farm. I, I, just, I just don't know. Uh, but following along with that tradition right there, I am going to go ahead and make myself a new shulker box full of equipment. That's right, we're going to make some safety boots here. My main aim at the moment is just to get these enchanted to get going with. I'm not really... Oh, I hate that. Uh, I'm not really caring too much what I get on there as long as it's not just... Just like fire protection uh, so I just coming along and doing a whole bunch of, uh, of, of enchanting here I'll take a protection three uh, I don't ooh. Ooh, that that's one that I'm not sure whether I'll take or not. And, th and this has been this has been my life for the past couple of hours or so. Uh, I do, I, I, you know, my death has just kind of come along and disrupted me. Let, let's go back to the hole in the floor over here. As you can see, I've got myself a little base and man, have I been doing some mining down here. Let's, let's go down a floor. You can see that I've gone all the way. If I press the H button, you can just see the red down the very end there. Uh, that has happened all the way across. Uh, I, I've done that all the way from 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 down there up to here this has taken me like legitimately a week of solid digging uh, i started off all the way down on the bottom let, let, let's get down there pretty far oh, get, get out of my way i've been using this to uh, to mark off where i need to to stop and uh, obviously at that point i didn't remove the block and take it with me just like that one but if we get down here you can see that i've been doing both directions and then like this this layer here is not actually high enough that I could keep that if I was to do this again if I was to do this again I would definitely make a wider spiral so that these didn't overlap 
like this. This this, this was horrendous. Like look look at this. This this. So that's why on the uh, the next floors up, when I when I finally realised how long this was actually going to take, uh, I I stopped digging. No, even even that way. So look, look how far I did it properly. Look how far I did it properly. But at some point, I stopped doing the left hand turns uh, because well, like honestly. You just go through them again. Look, look, you, you're just double checking. So um, I feel like I was doing much better just going in the one direction. And these are not all the riches. Not not even close to it. I've had to empty my shulker boxes many, many times here. But I'm finally up to the area where I can just kind of stand and like, and it just just gets got. Uh, putting the uh, putting the beacon down. Absolute lifesaver. But you, you noticed how fast I could go through the stone. Not, not deep slate. Oh no, not deep slate. You gotta sit here and dig this like old school. But yeah, I thought my unfortunate demise was as good a time as any to give us a uh, status update. That's what's going on. I'm gonna go make myself a shulker box full of safety boots. And uh, I mean, do you know how much, how expensive 27 mending books are? It's not cheap. <laughs> And so, I have a shulker box full of safety boots here. Most of them have depth strider, unbreaking depth strider, protection, feather falling and mending, and some of them don't have the depth strider. I'm not I'm not that bothered by that. The, the only thing I really wanted was the protection, the feather falling and the mending. Of course, I fall down a lot. So uh, yeah, we're, we're definitely gonna be keeping these safe here. It, that took me about a week. That took me about a week. And given that it took me about a week to uh, do all of this mining as well, that's right, that means that I am indeed a week behind my release schedule yet again but I'm going to uh, be carrying on just doing a little digs here picking up from where I left off down this way we will find the lava but it's okay this time I've come equipped with a whole bunch of fire resistance potions let's get our way down there as quick as we can uh, I'm also gonna grab a few of these out of the wall because I've no doubt gonna need them because down down the very end here down the, the we can we can see it we can see it I want to I want to dig these out at some point yeah here it is we we got we got lava to deal with but that Thankfully, this time I am fireproof, so uh, we're not not really gonna have to worry about it anywhere near as much this time. T turns out this should all be fine. The uh, the fire is a little bit worrisome, but I think with that I'm gonna say thank you very much for joining me for this adventure, ladies and gentlemen. I will see you guys next time where hopefully the fire has left my eyes, uh, and we will be going ahead and doing take my helmet off here we'll be going ahead and uh, I, I will hopefully have finished all of this digging and we're just we're gonna build an oil rig with a trident farm in it but i will see you then when we're gonna do that bye